Creed, your host, and we got JT over there on his new badass four-wheeler. We got Remy over there, and he's got his little pit bike up there. But check out JT's new badass four-wheeler. What you think, JT? It's badass for sure. I like it. It is. It's a pretty badass four-wheeler. For what he paid for it, I'm, I'm impressed. I, I, I would have bought it, so we worked that out. I would have bought it if I saw it for sale, so he got a good deal, I think. Um, we're out here, okay. Today we're, we're not on the claim, but we're not actually doing mining. We're doing something else that some miners have to deal with, and I'm one of them. Um, beavers are an invasive, evasive species here. They're a pest pain in your ass, okay? So, I went and filed the permits, got all the paperwork done, got all the licensing, so this, everything we're about to do is 100% legal. I have permits to take out six beaver and their dam off my mining claim and you'll see why you'll see the big lake we have to go through you shouldn't have to go through you should be able to just walk right through in tennis shoes so this everything you're about to see in this video again is totally legal totally legal jt says so no i actually have all the permits so it is 100 percent legal so yeah if your discretion may be advised um we probably will shoot show some shooting of beavers we probably will show some dead beavers at the end of this. I'm sorry if this offends you. If it does, um, I don't know, have a cooking, some milk, and <laughs> enjoy the show, right? This is just part of life, man. I mean, it is what it is. So, before you see all that, make sure you like and subscribe and leave a comment. Let's see if Remy crashes. <laughs> so. We're gonna get finished geared up and we're gonna get to the beaver dam. We got some chainsaws, we got some straps, we got all that. So best way to get a beaver to come out is mess up their beaver dam and guess what? They come out to fix it. So we'll be back. Remy's hot rod. I think you bought it because it had green fenders. <laughs> Stick it on your front rack. We're just going right up here and around, so we'll be back. Beaver eradication and dam disposal. Making a trail in and out to the beaver dam so it's accessible to us easily. Because we're gonna have to make trips back and forth. So, Remy's chopping, JT's throwing. He didn't clean the beginning of the trail. Hey, Remy, you forgot the whole beginning of the trail here. Like, <laughs> I, get I go, you got excited, ran into the forest, you didn't even start the trail. So, we'll be back. We got some logs to cut and stuff. And, we're not even to the dam close. There's a bunch of little dams we're gonna break, so the fevers are gone, baby. Hey, take this bitch, too. Take that big fucker. Oh, yeah. Wait. Get 
this is the life. Is this the life or what, JT? Yeah. This is life, right? Oh, yeah. Ryan can suck it. <laughs> suck it, boy. Yeah, yeah. This is definitely the life. Yeah, roughing it. Loving life, baby. It's a beautiful Saturday afternoon, sunny, out in the woods, playing with nature. Chop whatever, it's totally cool. So we're, we're working our way there. Yeah, we'll be back. Normally, this is dry ground. I'm up to my knees, so. Over here, this is all normally dry ground, so you can see. A little shit been busy. So, I mean, I'm up to my knees easy. So we got some logs right here. Reach over this to make it safer for us to get over there to destroy that. Oh, it's just been busy. Normally, it's just right there. It's even really busy. Normally, uh -huh. every bit of this is, is above ground, JT, or dry. So we're gonna get back to tomorrow. Push your here, Chris. <laughs> Grab this log, JT. Get it out of here. Hopefully, I don't block shit up. Get it up there on high ground, please. Yep. Throw it way up and away. Stand it up somewhere. Oh. Y'all okay. wanted real Alaskan life adventure. Well, this is it. This is really gonna piss the beavers off. So I'm gonna save more footage for the beaver footage. So be back. All right, we have started the eradication. Water has already gone down quite a bit. You can see the water line here. It's where we started. So we're gonna keep plugging it the way at the top of this dumb dam here. This used to be all dry land where I'm standing, so that's how high the beavers flooded our claim, Chris. Up to our knees where it used to be dry. Just look at this. So we're gonna rip some of that top off. Doing that makes a big difference. We've already ripped a ton apart in there. So it's it's flowing. <laughs> Never thought you'd do this, huh, JT? Heck no, a year ago. Yeah, <laughs> never thought you'd be in the wild in Alaska tearing a beaver dam apart with your hands out in the middle of nowhere. It's awesome. To find gold. Here you go, ready? Let me show everybody you're in Alaska tearing the dam apart, baby. Okay, you don't the wood up, out in the freezing cold place of water. Yep. Lift it up. Life in Alaska, baby. So, like, subscribe, leave a comment. We'll be back with more. We'll be heading around next to the <laughs> Yep. All right, everybody, you can see on the trees, we have done some serious damage. Soon, we'll go mess around for a little bit, and then we'll come back, and the pesky little rodents will be swimming with branches, and then we're gonna shoot them. Yep, remember, we have a permit for all of this, so it's totally legal. I got a nuisance permit, I'm allowed to get rid of six beavers. So I have a trapper's license and I'm a resident. So, and it's a nuisance. So don't bother complaining. So from here on out, might be some gory video here and there. I don't know. So if you don't like that, um, I don't know, have some popcorn and enjoy. <laughs> it's, called, it's called fucking nature, in fact, a life, right? This ain't winter, snowflakes go home. Yeah, snowflakes go home. This is Alaska life. This is what it is. So make sure you like, subscribe, leave a comment. We'll be back. See, we got to do this so we can go on mining because this is flooding my mining trails. So I got to get rid of this. So 
this is actually helping me. And right over there, obviously, Flower Go Wizards has been here because right there is a PBR can. <laughs> Jason's been here. Are you scoping my claim? Claim jumper. Claim jumper. <laughs> so we'll be back, but that that thing is a ripping. JT, see that big log right there? Get rid of it. <laughs> That's a dam right there. So we're gonna go break that up right there in the trees a little bit, you see? Right there. Look at the tip of my stubby right there. We're gonna go break some of that away. Just bust it to the side so this flows better. And, but already, major improvement. Couple hours, this will be dry in here. Or not dry, but it'll be, it won't be flooded anymore like it is. Cause you can see back over there, it's already drained a lot. I mean, look at those trees over there. Look how wet they are. How low that is. We've drained it about a foot. Yep. So pretty good so far. I'm determined to make as much water go as possible. Yep, we're gonna go do some more. And I just stopped because my finger's cold. <laughs> no, I'm not flipping you all off, my finger's cold. This one always gets cold, so we'll be back. Living the life, right, Remy? This is rough, huh? Oh, yeah. Huh? So hard. This is my childhood right here, basically. This is what we did for fun as kids. I wouldn't change it for all the video games and cell phones and crap at all for, uh-uh. I loved my childhood. It was awesome. Playing in the woods. Yeah. Forget all that city life. I feel sorry for the city kids, really. That's why I drag my daughter out into this, and she loves it, so... Happy with that. I mean, you can see where here's where a beaver was coming up and down. They've trenched it out a little bit. Yeah. That was while he was working. So we'll be back. All right, everybody, here we are. JT's got a bucket. He's having a blast. Yep. Remy's having a blast. We just tore up another beaver dam over there. A small one. So, I mean, you can see the water level. Every bit of that was underwater. You can see the water line. I mean, we've dropped this thing a foot. So we're gonna give it some time. This is flowing. Tristan JT put that across the little river. Oh, so, so, so. But that was way up there. That was Dan. Remy dug that out big time. So that's gonna get lowered. This all get lowered. That'll get lowered. We're gonna go mess around and go get some gold. Go play a little bit, let the beavers have a chance to investigate and start working, and then we're gonna come out and get rid of some beavers, hopefully. That's the plan. If not, we'll come back out and do it again. That's the plan, because we're getting rid of these guys. I'm tired of it. It's eviction time, baby. And it's legal, so we're getting rid of them. So we'll be back. We're gonna go get gold now. Later. All right, everybody, here we are on the creek. And that's the joy of having bibs on, huh, JT? Absolutely. You can just walk and not really care. I mean, you gotta kind of care because it gets deep in places and then you fill your gloves full of water so they're worthless now. <laughs> I'm fucking people. <laughs> this is deep. And very, very slippery. Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> walking on ice. Yeah, we Okay, so that's our hole from last time. We are going to make the side hole bigger. So, we are gonna strap you onto, I don't know, a tree somehow. Set a bucket right there, that's our classifier screen. And we have one shovel, but usually it's more rock moving and one shoveling anyway, so. We'll we might, fill the bucket up. We might be able to just throw on this like the old timers did and just scoop the shovel a pile up into our sands. Well, we gotta clean that bucket anyways. Oh. They used to just throw onto the screen, leaned up, and then work off the pile underneath it. Back How long you want to stay out in this fucking rain doing that? I'll go okay, well, Remy's got this great idea. He's going to drop it on the ground and then scoop it back off the ground. So, okay. I don't care. I was going to do it in a bucket, but we got to clean the bucket. But 
We'll be back when we get set up. Later. It's only raining its ass off. Yep. This is life, baby! AK style. Yep, okay. later. Hurry, buddy, that's how deep our hole is right at the moment. That's a lot of work. Okay, go ahead, JT. <laughs> how full the bucket is? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> See how hard it is to dig this ground? Oh, what was that? Hey, hey don't ever throw it. Even if it's pathetic, you still run it over the screen. But that was pathetic. <laughs> we can have a rich on that scoop, dude. Try to dump like in right here because it splashes that way. Chopping at it's not necessarily the best yeah. thing. Stick Get it in there and kind of work it in there and then scoop it. There you go. Uh, I think. I don't know, we're almost full. Yeah. Nice. Well, we're filling it. One more. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, dude. So, my bucket's full. We're going to get Remy a pan from way down deep. And then, I don't know what we're going to do. We're going to mess around some more, though. We'll be back. But we're mining, we're prospecting, baby. If they mine this is prospecting. We're gonna take this home and run this over the sluice, maybe, or something. I don't know what we're gonna do. Before, see what's in there. Right. Probably found a bunch of gold in it. There's like five ounces, JG. You wanna do that tonight? Yeah, we're super rich. That's mm, like 2,000 I don't know, we'll ounce. see. Yeah, we're rich. I wish it was five ounces. Or order some that pizza, freaking go through that. You'd be super rich. Big rich. Do you want more in there? Sure. Put it or put it in Remy's fucking pan. Fill his pan up. Try to fling these off while you're in the water. The bigger ones. Right. While your scoop's in the hole. <laughs> Flip the bigger yeah. ones off. Yep. Just fling those out. Don't throw them in your Don't hole. Throw them away. Fling them yeah. down in the river. Off the we'll be back. All right. Check it out. It's like about 6.30 at night, I think. So, still beautiful out kind of raining I don't know if we're gonna get mr. beavers or not tonight but I have to wait give him a day after we've just destroyed everything we've dropped this thing down feet feet baby I'm so happy I'll come out I might come back out tomorrow we'll see I got a couple things to do but It might come out tomorrow. So, I'm gonna go see where those guys are. So, we'll be back. All right, everybody. We are back here at my house. Update on yesterday's adventure. We got the dam broke down really good, but no beaver. So, we think they come out later at night. So, we're just gonna have to... Um, Go back. We got the dam tore down really good, so they're gonna be rebuilding it. I might actually go back later this afternoon. I know it's like nine o'clock, 10 o'clock in the morning here Sunday. This is our five gallon bucket of material. That's the only classifying screen I have. So I'm gonna have to get some. Chris took his and I didn't even think about it. So I'm gonna classify this all down so I can run it through the sluice. And we'll be back when we start running it. I'm sure you guys don't want to see classifying. That's boring. So I'll be back. What do you guys got to say? Is that your belly? Do you guys hear Diablo's belly go gurgle gurgle? <laughs> we'll be back. All right, everybody. I am back. And it went faster than I thought because I forgot... My kick-ass buddy, Kirk, from Secret Creek Prospecting, sent me one of those, uh, uh, um, uh, I don't remember what they're called, pan kits, those X XP, and I had classifiers right here. I totally forgot, so I used them, so it went faster. So, we've got this all out here now, so let's get it running and see what we got. Okay, so let's start it running. We got half a five gallon bucket. 
our dirt is right here, half a bucket. So, let's throw some good old goodiness on there. And see what kind of happiness we get. We got my old Kinky and Diablos are down here. Diablos on his chair over there being a boss. And Rinky's right here saying I'm gonna get paid at. So I'm gonna get to running this and we'll be back so you get to see some gold. Be back soon. All right, everybody, I just concreted the mats, which, you know, means tilt the thing to the side. If you look right there, gold, gold. Some VG right there, baby. I don't know if the light's going to kill it, so you can't, can't see it. But it's right there. Right there's two little pieces. So, I'm going to get this cleaned up, and we'll be back. Right, Rinky? There's Diablo being a kid. Gonna be, you know, he's vicious. All right, so that's what we're left. So let's get to panning, right? Get my stuffing bottle set up here. Sorry we didn't get to blast any beavers. We're gonna try that again later. Might go out there later today. We'll see. Just depends on how much time I have. Because I got to get this video out for you fine folks, too, today. And we'll just dump that and try that. See this? Jump this down a little more. There you go. Might go out and get a new camera mount too. I'm tired of this. No, well, there's a speck. Looking for more than that though. Hopefully there's more than that in here. there was two specks in there we saw them in the sluice so <laughs> we'll see how this goes so we'll be back all right buddy you can see the pan that's what we got i don't know what it is i'm not gonna weigh it but that's what we got out of that half a bucket so that's what it is oh there's the guard dog really working hard <laughs> So make sure you like, subscribe, leave a comment. We'll be back with more. Hopefully we'll be getting some beaver here soon. I never